fierce clashes on the front line continue. The Ukrainian army wants to take the Russian army by surprise by organizing reconnaissance operations to maintain an advantage. Therefore, the Ukrainian army is increasing the number of reconnaissance operations. Ukrainian reconnaissance groups continue their work. The reconnaissance teams provide the assault units with the coordinates of the Russian targets they have discovered. The Ukrainian army neutralizes more than 700 Russian servicemen daily by counterattack and defensive operations on the front line. A large amount of military equipment is also destroyed. One of Ukraine's goals and strategies is to leave Russian armored vehicles and Russian soldiers on the front lines without ammunition. For this reason, it detects Russian ammunition depots in the region and organizes attack operations using drones and long-range missiles in and around the ammunition depots. The Ukrainian army destroyed a Russian ammunition depot discovered on the front line the other day. The destruction of Russian ammunition depots on the front line is very good news for Ukraine and very bad news for Russian troops on the front line. The Ukrainian army is shelling not only the ammunition depots, but also the routes and neighborhoods that the Russians use to deliver these ammunition to the front line. The Ukrainian army is also hitting Russian oil refineries, radar stations and command centers, inflicting heavy casualties on the Russians. What do you think of the Ukrainian army's counterattacks and strategies?